Good morning, traders, oil traders. Uh, it's Monday, 8.24 a.m. Eastern. Uh, so we're still about an hour out from North American market open. And it looks like, at least so far, um, it was the right call to wait for today before selling my short. Um, so on Friday, I was look. Uh, you'll remember that I, I'm basically hedged um, long and short, but I'm biased about um, 60%, 40% weighted towards um, the short, the downside. So basically, as we go down, my portfolio was appreciating. Um, so this is good in general, um, but I was looking at exiting one of my two short positions, um, and I wanted that to happen below 44. Um, and it was mostly due to also wanting to purchase long, which I'll get to in a second. Um, so basically right now this morning, um, late this morning, we've been hanging around kind of the 43.80 level, um, as you can see down here. So on Friday, we touched um, 43.80 and then um, basically rapidly climbed and then hung out at the mid 44s and um, closing at those levels just to me didn't feel right. Like I didn't, I didn't believe that the bulls were actually going to succeed in taking us a lot higher. And I thought that the bears would get another chance at these um, sub 44 levels. So that was my, that was my reasoning um, for holding out. Um, and at least so far, it looks like we might open in that um, ballpark, um, which would be good enough for me. Um, so my target on Friday, you may recall, I was actually hoping for kind of the mid 43s, um, but that was kind of my greedy target to sell uh, the short at 43.60. That was where I actually had my order placed, as well as to buy um, a long position at 43 and a half. Uh, we of course never got there, but those were my those were my targets. That's where I actually had orders in um, in anticipation of maybe a sudden drop, um, which of course never happened. So if we actually do open um, at the 4380, uh, it's a price that I'm happy with. Uh, it's below 44, which is a nice resistance level. So that you know it gives me a warm and fuzzy feeling about buying long there so if i'm prepared to buy long there i should be also willing to take uh, my profit on the short so why am i thinking about doing this do i think it's going up or do i think it's going down um honestly i think we are going down lower uh, but just because i believe that we're going down lower doesn't mean that that's actually what's going to happen so um I think we are going to retest 42 and probably even lower than 42. Um, that being said, I think we're going to bounce around this range quite a bit. So having positions to play both long and short within this range uh, basically allows us to take profits and replay um, just based on the volatility. Um, so my whole kind of approach to this is, you know, what I believe doesn't matter, what they say in the news doesn't matter just play the action, um, take profits when you're being offered them, uh, and don't get too heavily weighted in any particular direction because no matter what you believe, no matter what anyone else believes, um, a lot of this is dictated just by uh, trader sentiment and technical analysis and what have you. So that's kind of my long and short of it. Uh, basically, keep it simple. Uh, so if, uh, if we do open in this range and I manage to sell my short and buy the long, um, if we then continue to drop, um, I'm going to be pretty patient um, looking at kind of near 42-ish as the next threshold. Keep in mind that I still, I will, I, even if I did all that, I would still have a short position that's growing in um, value. Um, so that's where I'd be looking to exit that position as well as to add yet another long position. Uh, but it just depends on how it plays out today. And honestly, I don't think we're going to get that low today, but who knows? Uh, so that's my thinking. I'd love to hear what you guys have in mind. Uh, shoot me uh, a note down below on uh, the comments on YouTube or hit me up on tradingjournal.ca where you can find more info on my portfolio uh, trades and charts. Uh, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to stay tuned, and I'll check back with you guys closer to uh, the end of trading. Cheers and good luck.